Hi, thanks for coming back. It's Matt here again with MyWebBro.com, and today I want to run you through a really powerful tool in the Google Ads dashboard. It's called the Google Ads Keyword Planner, and we use this tool in SEO to um, determine what are the best keywords in an industry and also to determine or to help to set a budget for digital advertising in the Google Ads platform. So um, a lot of the numbers that we present to business owners in the form of forecasting can come from this tool and tools like it. Um, but if you're comfortable using this tool in your Google Ads dashboard, then um, you would be comfortable probably using the other tools too because they're, they're very similar. So let's go ahead and take a look. So right here in your Google, dash, your Google Ads dashboard, you'll see the Tools and Settings button. And then right there is the Planning section. And then right here is the Keyword Planner. And it'll take you to this screen right here. Now in this screen, you've got two options to discover new keywords and to get search volume and forecasts. So let's just quickly take a look at both of them. And we're not going to go real deep into this. I just want to show it to you so you can see, so you see, you can see it exists. Um, knowing that it's there, um, you know, someday you may be able to get in there and have some fun with it. So let's say you wanted to discover new keywords um, that you maybe, you, you know, you're stumped on, in your industry, you're stumped on what you should be using as keywords. So you can come right here and let's use plumbing. Uh, just it's just something that I, I don't know just off the top of my head is use plumber so look you can go right here and you can type in the word plumber and of course um, you can get those results like this and you'll end up with you know the most relevant keywords in that industry and you'll need to do some exploring and some research to make sure that that stuff's all legitimate that you're looking at right there but but here let's go back real quick and do that and do something that sometimes people don't know they can do you can you can do this with a website and and one of the ways that SEO works is that if someone's succeeding, if someone is finding a lot of success in their efforts with SEO, then other people have the opportunity to utilize um, to utilize those efforts that you see are successful in your own business model because it's all sitting on the internet, it's all open source, and that it's there's nothing hidden about it. And here's proof of that right here. Let's go to Google and let's just look for a plumber really quick, really really broad, really really. Um, broad, uh, vast search for a plumber. And let's see who's who's winning in organic. And you'll see here, you got Angie's List, Yelp, Home Advisor, Ultimate Plumbing, and C. So they end up being like the first organic listing, if you look here on this page, will be Ultimate Plumbing, um, ultimateplumbinginc.com, I'm sorry. Um, the next one, North Neck Plumbing, Roto-Rooter. So since I know some of these guys in this industry, I don't want to go and hack into their website, but I will use these guys as an example. Um, I've just never, forgive me, but I've just never met these guys before, so I don't mind to go and do this. Um, I just don't I don't feel like I'm doing anything nefarious. NorthMechPlumbing.com, we can get these keywords from their website. And I mean, anybody can do this. It's just that sometimes we don't know we can do it. And right here is every keyword they've ever used, you know, and, and what's, what keywords are bringing them the most success right there. So now, that being said, you know, that's how you can determine what keywords you should be using, but that doesn't help you make a budget for advertising. And I'm going to show you how to do that now. Using the volume and forecasts um, tile, right? So right here, here are some of the keywords in plumbing that are, that are, that are powerful. And so I just, I did enough research, I just grabbed these from somewhere. And what I'll do is I'll paste them right here, okay? And so these are the keywords that are most, um, it's funny, the, the word misspelled is one of them, that's pre pretty funny. Okay, so let's get started and let's see what it, what it spits out. And what it's going to spit out is a lot of really cool data for us. So since we added so many keywords, there's going to be a, a lot of clicks and impressions to be bought, right? But what we can do, obviously, is we can scale down a lot of that by focusing on one of our services or a niche service that we're best at, right? So, but here's some data. I mean, this is a great place for a business owner to start if they're just trying to figure out what's a budget for internet marketing. Well, if you want to be somewhere near the top of this auction, this advertising auction, um, you're going to need to have a daily budget of $23,000. A daily budget of $23,000. Because why? Well, because we put 25 keywords in and we're trying to rank high for 25 different keywords in a very large market. Actually, look, all of the United States, right? So to, to be a national 
plumbing service provider and to compete in this ad market, we would need a $23,000 a day budget or about $120,000 a month or about a million and a half dollars a year. That's how we make budgets, you know, and there are national plumbing service providers out there, right? A good example of that is right here. You've got companies that are buying these keywords that aren't actually plumbers. Angie's List, Yelp, Home Advisor. So these are companies that actually use this data here to forecast. Now, if you're a local plumber, what you're going to do is you're going to come in here and you're going to put in a zip code, right? And I'll just put in my zip code because, you know, I'm in Huntersville, whatever. And look, I'll put in a zip code. Um, okay, maybe I won't let me put in a, so I'll do this. Okay, whatever. So there, my reach now has gone from 267 million people to 399,000 people. And we save that and watch how, watch how now I can get a more realistic budget in my area. In just that zip code or just that city of Huntersville, I can see that for about $3 a day, I could be pretty much on top of that auction for these keywords, right? And that's great. That's great information. So thank you so much for coming back and watching my YouTube channel. Um, you know, these things that we're looking at here are just the very surface of what we do to make sure that search engine optimization is happening uh, in your business. So um, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. You can find us at mywebbro.com. You can find my WordPress agency at daswow.com. And... Uh, and uh, you can buy our products and services online at a website, trafficisourjam.com. Trafficisourjam.com is a great place to go if you want to make a purchase and you want to be onboarded and you want all that to be streamlined and automated. You get access to a portal and you don't have to do all the decision making and, all, and have all the conversations you normally have to have with a web developer if that's your, the way that you like to do things. Have a great day. Thank you. Bye.